Since 1965, Washington Performing Arts has had a foundational role in the cultural life of our nation's capital. But offstage and away from the footlights, we've also had a central foundational role in the lives of Washington, D.C.'s adults and, more importantly, Washington, D.C.'s children. If you live here, chances are you know someone who's participated in Washington Performing Arts education and community programs. Whether in a classroom, auditorium, at a summer camp, or in a community setting, Washington Performing Arts has made arts education happen for decades. Among our many signature programs, the Embassy Adoption Program is one that simply could not exist anywhere else in the country. For 40 years, Washington Performing Arts and the D.C. public schools have been making global local for 5th and 6th grade students across the district. Each year, more than 50 embassies and 50 5th and 6th grade classes are paired together to learn about and celebrate the diverse cultures and unique communities in D.C. and around the world. Through in-class visits, field trips, participation in model UN events at the U.S. State Department, and student-led performances, children grow more aware of their multicultural surroundings and use their knowledge of other cultures in future studies. Some have even gone on to careers in the Foreign Service. The breadth of what Washington Performing Arts is able to provide is huge. Everything from jazz musicians like myself to string programs to African dancing to storytellers, it's, uh, it's the, the widest definition of the arts. And it's, uh, I don't know any other city in the country that has something like this. I talk to my friends in Nashville and Los Angeles and New York, and they can't believe the work that we get to do here in DC, thanks to Washington Performing Arts. Another signature program is Washington Performing Arts Capital Arts Program, with more than 25 world-class teaching artists performing and working in schools throughout the region. In fact, Wynton Marsalis and Jazz at Lincoln Center was one of our first partners in Capital Jazz. To me, I always say um, music is life. Washington Performing Arts gives a lot of students really good opportunities and they really have one of the greatest um, music programs ever for young people like me. The Capital Arts Partnership programs include Capital Jazz, Capital Strings, Capital Voices, and Capital Dance. Each one gives our students the opportunity to learn from professional performing artists from across the country and perform in venues across the city. Having access to Wynton Marsalis for some of my kids for a meet and greet, being able to take them to a Kennedy Center concert, all of that makes my job easier because the kids aren't just hearing me talk about it, but they're experiencing it. And so not only are they learning, but they're learning to enjoy music. They hear the truth from professional musicians. All of those things are they're invaluable and they're irreplaceable. With Washington Performing Arts, arts experiences don't end at the close of the school year. Through summer camps like Playful Rhythms, Capital Strings, Summer Steps with Step Africa, and the Summer Vocal Workshop, Washington Performing Arts offers students the opportunity to be creative and imaginative year-round. Every student receives a full scholarship to participate. Following the words of Washington Performing Arts founder Patrick Hayes, everybody in, nobody out. Without Washington Performing Arts Society, I probably wouldn't be singing outside of church, if at all. For over 20 years, Washington Performing Arts has proudly sponsored two resident ensembles, the men and women of the gospel and the children of the gospel choirs. Singers from across the region join our choirs for the exceptional training and high musical ideals that are visible and audible in every performance. Recently, two young performers who participated in our gospel music program from a young age were featured on the main stage in a very special way. Yes, The uniqueness to Washington Performing Arts COTG is that there is no other choir in the DMV that is like it. Not in sound, not in who we are able to attract, not in the experiences and the outlets that these um, children are having the opportunity to perform in. To have a free program where he's building a resume that if he decides to go into a music program in college, 
you know, is unbeatable. He can put it down that he's, you know, sing at Mandela's memorial. He's been to the White House. He's done all these different things. And I often tell him, you know, there are 15 year olds in the world who only think about it. And then you get to say you got to do it. That motivation that I get from my singing, I say to myself, if I can do that with my singing, I can do that with my grades and I can do that with parts of my other parts of my life. These are just a few of the many educational and community programs that distinguish Washington performing arts locally and nationally. Add to these the newly launched Mars Urban Arts Initiative, and we have an organization with its own unique DNA, unlike any other in the United States. Just last year, President Barack Obama recognized Washington Performing Arts with the first National Medal of Arts ever awarded to an arts-presenting institution. We are the performers the educators, the supporters, the conveners. With you, we make it happen. Thank you, Washington Performing Arts. Thank you, Washington Performing Arts Society, for the awesome opportunities you've given Charles. Thank you. Thank you, Washington Performing Arts. On behalf of uh, my students, the staff, the administration here at Stuart Hobson Middle School, um, I want to thank Washington Performing Arts for bringing the Capital Jazz Project to our students. You're making a huge difference, and you're changing lives every time you come. Thank you, Washington Performing Arts. I just want to say thank you so much because this has helped me a lot, spiritually, physically, and it's done so much with my motivation. Thank you. Thank you so much for being so impactful in the lives of these children.